So there's been some talk from my fellow predator fish keepers. They're saying Chris has gone soft. Um, he has his new little beta tank, his fancy goldfish, his little planted tank. Uh, guys, <sighs> predator fish are my heart and soul to this hobby, and it's not going to go anywhere. I, I apologize I haven't done a video. And to show you guys this, I'm going to do a wolf fish feeding compilation. A lot of times these videos get removed on YouTube, and they can get your account in trouble. So fingers crossed, let's do this. After browsing and looking for so many videos on wolf fish feedings, I gotta personally say these fish honestly freak me out. Look at how creepy they look. It's almost like they are smarter than what we think they are or they just know something that we don't. I know that might sound really weird, but these fish, what makes them super, super creepy is they just strike pretty much anything that's around them. Like some fish just will eat because they're hungry. Look at, look at here. This thing, this guy's just throwing a handle of a fish net in there and it's just striking out of just pure curiosity slash boredom slash get out of my space I will kill you and man the mouth of a wolf fish is just full of razor sharp teeth I am absolutely certain these are probably the meanest aquarium fish we can keep and I would say the snakehead is probably a really really close second look at this video here this is a bullfrog and it's a massive huge frog I, I really don't like showing these kind of videos, if I'm being honest, but it should it really shows the honest brutality that these fish have. And, you know, I couldn't imagine swimming in a river with one of these fish, unlike the Amazon. And it's it's kind of a scary thought. Like, if one of these things went at your ankle, like, what kind of damage could it do just out of... You know, if it had an agenda on its list, this fish could take out some mad, uh, I don't even know what I'm talking about. If one of these things bit you, you would be in a bad scenario. Here's a video here. Um, this wolf fish has just got done consuming a mouse and it's just sitting there hanging out. Uh, it's, it's scary guys. Like the wolf fish, you know, I was thinking the other day too, like what there's, what drives a predator fish keeper to keep these insanely insane fish like we have some people that like to keep peaceful rainbows or maybe you keep live bears and then you have fish keepers that like to keep fish like this look at this look at this poor mouse just running around um <laughs> there's really nothing more to say other than it's just absolute chaos like uh warning this is graphic this is graphic media so i i should mention that um there's different species of the wolf fish and what i did was i jumped in some of the bigger facebook groups um predator nation uh predator fish lovers the wolf fish is usually a specific species or a species specific tank only just because they're just crazy predators a lot of them are they they do a lot of their feeding at night so they're going to just strike the tank mates at night guys let me know what you think of the wolf fish i am absolutely i'm blown away by this fish and i'm i'm afraid of it deeply afraid um let me know what you think of it in the comment section is this cool to you or is it not